Private swim lessons are the best way to go for most people. The reason is that it's way faster. If you can imagine a group lesson with four two-year-olds or four three-year-olds or some combination thereof in it, you can imagine what the teacher has to, to keep that lesson together and, and to make some progress with some of the kids. You have kids that are whining, kids that are afraid, and kids that are uh, action heroes jumping in the water at any time, and that teacher has to be fantastic to keep all that together and, and do that lesson and do it efficiently, and it doesn't happen very often. The reason we do private lessons most of the time is because we can make uh, rapid progress with all the kids and we can work exactly on what the child needs, not uh, what the group needs. Sometimes one kid in the good group is really good and he can do his kicks, but one other child can't kick at all, so what do they end up doing? Who, who do they choose? So that's what you're up against in a group lesson and that's why it takes quite a bit longer. The other thing about uh, uh, private lessons as well. I'll tell you a story. We had a kid here from a, a group lesson swim school and he could swim halfway across that pool after he'd been there for four years. He was five years old so he'd been there a long time and within 10 lessons we taught him to swim all the way across the pool with side breathing. He's now on a swim team. That's a private lesson. 10 lessons versus four years how many lessons did they have? A couple hundred probably, okay? I'm not saying he would have done it faster here when he was two years old, but the, the rate of improvement is way faster. 